Starbuck. You ready for dinner, baby? It's raining. I know. Guys, it is actually raining here by me right now as we speak. You want to eat? Here. I'll put everything in a bucket. Here, baby. Come here. I'm gonna put everything in this bucket because for me to sit down, if I sit down there, me and him, we're both gonna get wet. So at least now we're underneath the tree. So we're kind of protected. I put five strawberries in his bowl today and two apples. So he has five strawberries and two apples. Then I end up putting more water in his bucket. He still has his pumpkins. Hey baby, you okay? I end up calling him because he wasn't at the spot. So I was like, let me call him. That's my dog barking at the probably at the delivery driver because some delivery, I don't know if it's Amazon, somebody just went up our driveway. But that's why I wanted to feed him on this side because it's really, it's more for the rain, not even for the truck. Because from this side, this tree protects us. See, it's a kind of like an umbrella a little bit. So it kind of protects us a little bit. I know that's ginger, but it's okay. It's ginger. It's okay, baby. Do you hear noise that way? That way I don't see nobody or nothing. It's okay, baby. At least he came for dinner because I was like debating on coming out or not. Because it's not raining really hard. It's like a little bit more than a drizzle. So I was like debating, I was like, shit, do I feed him? Do I go over there and put the corn in the water and some fruits in his bucket and just leave? But then I don't want to do that. I don't want to leave fruit in his buckets without him being here. Cause then I feel like in another half hour or not, another hour, it starts getting dark and the raccoons come out. So they're going to be eating all his good stuff, you know? So that's why I usually don't like leaving the goodies in his bucket unless I know like he's close by. Which he's always close by, but like I want to be able to see him that he's close by. So I'm like, okay, look, I'm dropping your goods in here. My big boy, you're eating? Today you eat on your own. Oh, and I know he's probably, his body, the back is probably getting wet, but his head will stay dry. At least while he's eating, he won't have water drops falling on him. He's probably like finding the strawberries right now and the apples. He's probably like, yum. Rain or shine, I never disappoint him. I always come out. My husband thinks I'm crazy sometimes because he's like, you go outside, you want to rain? Where'd you go, baby? What happened? I don't know where you heard. What did you hear? Oh, maybe that truck. That's why. It's okay, bud. Come here. Come over here. Go your bucket. Now he's standing in a place where he could be seeing. All right, they left. No more. No more, baby. It's okay. Did he eat everything? Oh, you ate everything too. Good boy. You're okay. Yeah, you see, he ran from the truck. The truck left, baby. The truck left. You're okay. Well, he ate all his fruits and stuff. I don't know why he keeps looking down there. I'm wondering if that little buck is still down there, like inside this forest. I don't know, guys. I only see one video of that little buck, which was like a nighttime video, the one that I posted. I didn't see any daytime videos of that buck, the young one. So I don't know if he's still in this forest or if he left, like, I don't know. And it was November 1st when he came. I thought it was recently, but it wasn't recently. It was November 1st. And I noticed too, there's a video of November 1st of Buck, like walking by over here and hanging out here and smelling everything. So Buck definitely had to pick up his scent and smell him. I just like, I wonder what happened like when they bumped, like, you know, they seen each other. I don't know. Usually if there's no females around, like when Bucks are close by each other, I don't think they'll fight. Cause I heard they only fight for the females. So maybe they didn't like, you know, they didn't fight or anything. I don't think so. Or either that buck got, the young one got scared when he's seeing this big boy. He must have been like, oh, let me go because he's big. 
You know, he's probably like, I don't want to get on his bad foot. All right, guys. I'm going to get going because it is raining. And Buck left. He ate his dinner. I'm happy. At least he had his dinner, you know? That's why I came on here to make sure to give him his dinner and stuff. And you see, now it's starting to get dark because it's a little bit after four. I wasn't expecting it to get. Look how dark it gets so quick. And it's only like probably 4.30ish. It's not even 5 o'clock yet. And it's already dark. And it's raining. It sucks. It really does. You know, between this weather today and it's been looking gray all day. It was looking gray, you know? It wasn't like no sun out today. Like it wasn't that great. But I mean, this morning I think a little bit of sun, but then it went away. But it's all right. As long as he ate, he has his corn. He has water to last him throughout the whole night until tomorrow morning. All right, guys, his pumpkins are still there. So that's good. I will be back tomorrow morning with another video. Like I said, right now with him being in rut, the videos are gonna be a little shorter because you know, he eats and leaves, that's what he does. But my husband said he was doing the same thing last year too, and the year before that. So my husband's like, babe, he does do that. He was like around this time. He never hung out with you long enough. He used to eat and leave. I was like, oh, I was like, I kind of forgot. <laughs> but I guess, yeah, but it's okay. As long as I get to see him, he, I know he's doing okay and he's close by, it makes me happy, you know? All right, everyone, enough of my rambling. I'll be back tomorrow morning. I threw bread for the raccoons, hoping like, you know, they don't go next to the bucket and now with the rain, the bread will get wet. So maybe they won't try to eat the corn. I don't know, we'll see. I don't know. <laughs> I'll be back tomorrow morning with another video, everyone. Have a great night, have a good night, and ciao for now.